uh, forever. I mean, we've already got the steepest uh, slope ever uh, for a Red Bull track, and for anyone that has not been up there, I was up there this morning for an interview, and I, I'm telling you, you know that feeling you get with a roller coaster when it's ready to go? <laughs> Imagine going down a roller coaster in skates. The best way I can describe it is I say this is hockey, roller derby, and downhill skiing all on a bobsled course. And we'll skate it. for one or two strides before jumping into the, 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 the track, the slope, and then going all the way down. And do you think that they will have to skate a lot to go up here? <laughs> not too much. Actually, they will have to break to not hit the wall there. Because it will be really fast. There's a jump there, which is a, which is called a floater. So a floater is somehow just a, it's not a jump. We'll kick you up in the air, but it just make you fly over. So they will, you will, you will see them fly over this bump for about two, three feet high and then land maybe 10 feet or 15 feet further back then gliding all the way up here and break to be sure that they won't hit each other or they won't hit the wall before going down into the second section and this this would be a technical part as you can see it's not level so the guys cannot skate on that part so they will have to re to, to keep their speed and, and and bring their speed from the top here to the green lane to the double there to be able to absorb it. Most of them will absorb it. It's, it's pretty pretty huge, you can see. The guys are standing beside it. It's about four feet high, maybe five. Um, so it's pretty pretty big, pretty massive stuff. And of course, they will lose some speed till there. From here, you cannot really see it, but there's a, there's a step down for about two, two feet high. Then entering the bank turn, which is a special feature here in Niagara. Um, as you can see, it looks it looks special, and for sure it will be special to ride as well. So they are gonna go down here, skate, have a turn, and the finish line will be pretty much where the the, the black aluminum tower is. Um, this might be the the finish lane. So the guys will skate a bit uphill, not too much, but then you can imagine how exhausting the uh, how exhausted the guy will be here. So all these little things and skate and crossing till the finish will just kill them and and those who we will see which which in in, uh, in the pack really train during the summertime or did they just enjoy summer with beers this is a free event so Red Bull invite the people and the city invite the people to come here it's free access it's uh, we have places to put a lot of people but we may we have to ensure that the circulation of the public is easy and uh, people can walk from one place to another. We don't put any grandstand or, you know, like a big units where people can sit. It's a place where people come and they walk around, they, do, they find the best spot with a screen, and they watch the show and they enjoy it. Naturally, in Niagara.